Welcome back to Star Made News, and this time what I'm going to be doing is just giving you a quick update on Dev News number two. It came out a couple of days ago, but I had a bit of a family birthday and uh, couldn't get at my computers for the weekend. So here it is. I'm just going to be showing you the update. So Schema says, I'm a lot better. Thank you for all your wishes and support. Here is a little teaser. Uh, of what was just finished. So what we're going to do is just have a little look. See here, we've got three pictures from Schema. I'm going to read out his text, and then we're going to have a little closer look. So, basically, introduction to all new shapes. A tetrahedron-like shape that is composed of triangles, picture number two. Um, so we'll just open that up. A five-sided cube that is missing a tetrahedron-like shape, which is picture three. And he's redesigned the orientation system, cleaned up some code that was around for a long time and giving him some trouble. Fortunately, the game has now the option to soft migrate the database in real time. The new format, finally, for 32 types of orientation, and I finally added the missing corner shapes as well. The reason why it takes a little longer to implement star-made voxel shapes instead of with normal 3D objects is purely performance-based. The new shapes don't actually take any performance away from the game and don't take any more memory. Each shape and block only takes 3 bytes in the RAM and 12 bytes on the graphic card's RAM. As you can see, the sprite shapes in pick 1 can be placed in any orientation as well, which is something I'm pretty hyped about. Just, just you know. Uh, I hope to release a test version as soon as all the artwork for the new player model is finished and integrated into the game. And we got a bunch of comments saying thanks very much, Schema. So let's take a quick look at picture one. Well, in fact, it was picture two first for the tetrahedron-like shape. So that'll be this one just here. Um, as you can see, it's a triangular wedge corner piece with a triangular bottom. If you look at the old corner pieces, they have a they're a triangle with a square base. This is a this is a you know. Uh, exactly. He said it better himself when he called it a tetrahedron-like shape. So there's that one. This one here is the uh, part that would go with the tetrahedron-like shape. So <clears throat> this is going to allow us to do the insides of corners. As you can see, you've got the... Um, uh, you can put your wedge in there or here. But anyway, anybody looking at this is going to know what that means. Um, and if you don't, you'll get to play with it soon, so no problems. Uh, so that'll be that one. And these are epic. If you, you've been wanting to do the insides of corners with wedges, and now you can. So, And finally, as you can see, the flowers are on each side, which is awesome. Because that means that you could do, like, um, the old rotating stations that have gravity from rotating and so everything is on the inside edge and obviously you wouldn't have been able to put any vegetation down before but now you can so that'll be easier to make it look right which is cool um, all power to schema can't wait to see the uh, next dev release he's saying he's hoping to release a test version as soon as all the artwork for the new player models finished and integrated into the game I myself can't wait so uh, take your time is, you know, all I can say about that, and I can't wait to start playing with these new, these new things. They look amazing. But anyway, maybe I'm just getting a little hyped. Um, so uh, yeah, be sure to check out Mushroom Fleet community. Um, we do have a lot of information up there, encouraging people to post up their screenshots of their work in progress and so on and. Even even just like, you know, songs that you listen to when you're building, you know, whatever. Um, also, be sure to go over to the StarMade Reddit subreddit. That's, star, that's reddit.com slash r slash StarMade. Be sure to go up there because there's a lot of stuff up here. And uh, that's pretty much all I've got for you today, guys. So thanks for watching. And I will see you next time. In a world filled with countless unexplored planets, unlimited resources, and the danger space pirates bring with them, one man sets out to earn money for his family. This journey will change his life 
forever. Mayday, mayday, this is the pilot of the Dojo Mark 1. Video Dojo presents Star Made Deep Space Adventures. Just a quick note while I'm talking about adverts, send me your adverts. Your advert could be on the news. I want to see public server adverts. I want to see machinima adverts. I'd like to see tools that people have made for the game as an advert. Hell, I'll even make them for you, but you need to get in touch. So it's mushroomfleet at gmail.com. We'll help you. We're interested in expanding the uh, Star Made In engine commercials can also just use flashy stuff that you've put together in an editor, it doesn't have to be an engine, but just something to say, hey, this is our public server, this is our address, come join us, okay, or whatever. So, and with that, I'll leave you with the final ad, so thanks again for watching, I'll see you next time.